Hi, my name is Jason Lam, and I'm a principal instructor for the Sense Institute. This video series covers the eight domains of cloud security maturity model that I developed based on my 20 plus years of experience as a security leader, technologist, and cloud expert. This framework guides organization along the complex journey of achieving a high level of cloud security with measurable progress along the way. There are three areas of focus under data protection. They are data encryption, data classification and protection, and lastly, data backup and resiliency in the cloud. Data security involves encrypting data at all stages, while stored, which is also known as at rest, while being transferred, which is in motion, and while being used, which is also known as in-use encryption. A crucial decision for businesses is how to manage your encryption keys. Choosing between cloud service provider managed keys and the more complex models such as bring your own key, or the most sophisticated model of hold your own key, otherwise known as HYOK. This particular decision has significant security implication, and the evaluation should extend beyond just technical considerations. For another focus, which is data classification and protection, your cloud providers offer powerful services that can automatically find and categorize sensitive data within your cloud storage. These services allow organizations to implement targeted data protection strategy. The strategy may include anonymizing the data or using sensitive levels to control access, aligning with zero trust security models. Then another focus, which is the data backup and resiliency. In an ideal scenario, your data backup should be a cloud-wide technical policy that mandate all crucial cloud resources backing up data to a centralized location with stringent access controls. This centralized backup should be geographically redundant and follow a defined retention policy. The other aspect of that is recovering data also requires an extensive preparation process, ensuring a smooth and efficient process to rebuild your environment, and then also the data elements should you encounter any disaster or data incident. You can download your free copy of this maturity model at sans.org slash CSMM. As organizations actively migrate applications and computing environments to the public cloud, it is imperative to transform the organization's security program to address the risk in this new technology. That's why I wrote SANS LDR 520, Cloud Security for Leaders. This five-day course uses the cloud security maturity model as the foundation to teach leaders like you what you need to know about developing your cloud roadmap for maximum security. While aligning it with your organization's overall business strategy and goals, you not only learn about theories, but practice real life skills using case scenarios, group discussions, and Cyber42, which is our team-based security leadership simulation with embedded real life technical components to help you absorb both technical and management topics. Learn more about SANS LDR 520, Cloud Security for Leaders, and the various training modalities to choose from at sans.org slash LDR 520, and explore a free hour of the training material while you're there.